What's up everybody? It's Oni making a video again while I'm going to work. Um I don't understand these fucking people. I really don't understand them. They sit there like a lot of people bitch and and talk about they're atheists because they don't like a god that sends them to hell for the actions that they do. They never they leave that part out about the actions you do, about you sending yourself to hell god tells you what to do to get into heaven it's not hard you have to be you have to take jesus as your savior you have to be baptized well you don't have to be baptized but you should be baptized and try not to sin and even if you do sin guess what you can ask for forgiveness that's easy right but no most people don't want to do that because they don't like somebody telling them you need to act a little bit like a decent human being they don't like that shit. And uh, I was watching this fucking social justice dickhead that does like a news show. I don't even want to. I don't want to tell who he is because I don't like telling these people's channels and shit and getting them more views because people go there and watch their videos. I know a lot of people don't watch my videos, but still, I do get some people watching, and I don't want them to go over and give them any fucking traffic. And he says, talk about, he's talking about Elon Musk and how shitty Elon Musk is, which I don't, I don't know that much about Elon Musk. I don't worry about him. I just think he's some, you know, some rich guy that cares about going to space way too fucking much, which I heard he had, he has autism. Maybe that's part of the reason why he's so obsessed with space. I don't know. Uh, but... He talk, Denise was talking about how internet changed everything and and, for, and including social justice where people realize that cops shouldn't have guns. Okay, motherfucker, you're a fucking retard. That's one of the, he, he makes a lot of good points in that video. If, if what he's saying is true, I, like I said, I don't know a lot about Elon Musk. I just know that like when he was doing the SpaceX, when he was taste, testing the rockets and shit, one of the pilots got killed, which that happens all the time when you're trying something new, especially like something dangerous like rockets going into space and shit. So, I mean, that happens. You know, a bunch of pilots died when they first made jet engines. That's just something you take a risk being a pilot, especially on something experimental. But uh, he said cops shouldn't have guns. Well, I hope all these people that are bitching about the cops get in some situation where some asshole's got a gun to their fucking head and then the cops come and guess what? Oh, I left my gun at home. Sorry, asshole. I guess you're just going to get killed. That would be funny as hell. That would be their just desserts right there. I wish shit, but that don't happen like that, see? All these assholes that complain about the cops never have that shit happen to them because mostly they're pussy cowards and they probably never go nowhere. They, they just stay in their little fucking area and these people are usually the most racist fucking people on the planet. They treat black people like pets. Like, come here little, little pet. Come here, let me pet you. You know you can't do that. You're not smart enough to do that. That's the way they treat black people. Like they're like they're pets and they're stupid stupid Neanderthal human beings or something. Like they can't do nothing on their own or anything. And I, maybe if you would leave them leave them the fuck alone and encourage them instead of like acting like they're babies, maybe they would start doing stuff on their own. Maybe some of them would get out of this funk they're in about you know acting you know very you know, act, behaving badly and shit like that. Maybe if you let the community, you know, you know, do their thing and try to, you know, encourage people to do the right thing, you know, maybe hire people, I don't know, I, I'd say that they should have more black cops patrol black neighborhoods anyways. I think that would help a lot, but I don't know how many black cops there are in certain areas, so yeah, you gotta have white cops too. But I think they should have at least one black cop on duty in a black neighborhood at a time. That way he can 
That way, maybe they would come, but I don't know, maybe they'd see him as the enemy, all these gangbanger dumbasses. They're not very bright people, but, I mean, some of them are, some of them are, some of them are smart. I've met some people I used to know that were, uh, like, used to be gangbangers, but they quit doing that shit. They were pretty intelligent, but maybe that's why they quit doing that shit, because they, they realized it wasn't getting them nowhere. But... I don't know, they act like that's their only choice to do, you know, do criminal shit and be a thug and sell dope and all that bunch of shit. You got plenty of options. It's just you have to fucking work. You can't sit on your ass on the corner and just sit there and let drug acts run up till you give you money. That's easy work. That's sitting on your ass and not doing anything. But anyways, that's, I'm just, that's about it. But, see you later.